please, please, please work. Oh my God. <laughs> Honestly, this has been an absolute nightmare. Quick one, everybody's been asking where are the videos, where are the videos? Well, firstly, the Warsaw one corrupted when I was away, and then I filmed every single other shoe, and only the Stepfen video came through. All the others corrupted. I worked out it was a bit of a shonky SD card. So, fresh SD card in now. Let's hope this works. Anyway, welcome back to Alex Me, Danny. And we are going to go through all the shoes. Uh, not the stat film because I've already done a full video on it. And we don't need to do five full shoes on it. But we're going to go quickly through all the shoes of the Special 22 drop. So we're going to go back to the start. We're going to go back to the first shoes that were shown. And these are the Warsaw... SP ZL. You probably read Gary's post, so I won't go too much into it. But the name of the shoe came before the shoe, which I think, and, I, and I've touched on it a few times before, it's so hard to clear names for shoes, especially if it's like a city or a place or a name or something like that, to get something clear so then you can use it. So you've seen Gary's post about uh, David Bowie and the Low Album. And also uh, Joy Division, they were previously called Warsaw, and all the kind of links that go towards this. And then the shoe was based, well, the colours, let me, let's get the shoe out and we'll have a look at it. And you're going to hear this a lot of times today. Here we go. So check these bad boys out. What we're saying about these then? Loads of people. And I'll say it to probably a little bit more as we go along. Loads of people are picking up loads of different shoes and saying, I like this one the best, that one the best, and so on and so on. Unsurprisingly, a lot of the guys that are into the City Series absolutely love the shoe. What can I say? The red pictures do not do the colour justice. It is such a, such a beautiful colour. Um, the colours that came from the, the palette of buildings, in Warsaw actually, obviously a red and white one would have been easy for Poland, but this is what it is. And then they've just dialed up the, the tones a little bit, so just brighten them up because as you can see, the red is like I say, is a really nice colour, but the yellow is such a bright colour on there as well. It really does stand out. One thing I do really like on the Warsaws, I love this curved uh, toe here on, on like the T-bar toe. It's such a cool little aspect. Actually came from an archived Argentine, uh, Argentinian shoe, which Gary had. Not even a flat sole City Series or anything like that. It was just a little aspect. And do you know what? That's what I love about Speciales. They bring little elements from vintage shoes or old shoes or things from the past and put them with a new twist. Do you know, that's one of the things that they do really well. What else to show you? Obviously it's got... I have actually got my Blackburns to hand, um, so I'll pop them out, because I'm going to do a comparison size-wise. So it's got the same, similar sort of tongue, like this rubberized tongue with the Special logos all on there. Uh, it's got the Special heel tab, and also the other one has got the trefoil, which is like a familiar thing now. Uh, I think all these shoes that have something on the heel have a trefoil uh, and a mod trefoil as well. Blue sole, which I thought, when I first saw them, why is it a blue sole? And then when I got my Blackburns out, I was like, ah, well, Blackburns have a blue sole. The e have a blue sole. So maybe like the City Series is going to have a blue sole. And Gary even said himself, he worked on the Manchester originally, back, way back when, and that had a blue sole. So that's why we put it on the Blackburn. And it's like a little continuation, so I wonder if or when the next City Series comes out from Special, is it going to have a blue, blue sole? Hmm, wonder. Let's try these on. So, like I said, I've got my Blackburns for sizing. Now, these are an 8, and these fit me perfectly. You're going to have to excuse the socks. I put cream socks on to match the ZX's that are going to come up in a bit. And, and they fit beautifully. Now, what I'd say is the Warsaw, ever so slightly. I know I've worn my Blackburns, but not too many times. 
the Warsaw is ever so slightly more snug around the toe. And I think it might be this overlay here, I'm not quite sure. I'd still go true to size, I really would. But if you were going to go half up like not a lot of people did on the Bowerlands, then by all means go, go half up. So yeah, I'm not going to spend too much time because I realise I've got a lot of stuff to get through. So there's the Warsaw SP ZL. I really like them. I, I don't wear too many City Series, so I've got to be brutally honest about it. Um, it's not something I'd probably pick up myself because it's just like a when would you wear it kind of thing. But they are a really, really, the colour is what gets me. I almost, it, it's, it's swaying my mind to get a pair because the colour's so good. Right, we'll leave those there. Uh, next up, we have got the ZX620 SP ZL. Oh, here we go. Check these bad boys out. I think these are absolutely stunning. In fact, I'm just going to change the lighting one second. Oh, I just changed the lighting because for these because you can see the colours a bit better. It was a little bit bright shining on it there. So you've probably seen, uh, again, all Gary's posts. Wanted to make a, a ZX600 and couldn't find the tooling. Found the women's 602 and then used that as the basis for this shoe. Obviously then that's just changed the, the numbers around to get 620, why not? It looks just like it should be from back in the day, don't I mean, it, it just does. And then it's just got these little hints that it is modern. Do you know, so obviously the, the, the suede is a really nice suede. I would be worried a little bit about getting it mucky, but you know, wear your trainers and all that. Uh, and it's got like a nice mesh on the toe. These little vent holes, if that's what they are, actually have got some 3M hits underneath. Um, only noticed that because I put them all on the, uh, on the fireplace, like I always do. And I think it was my little lad who was trying to talk to me, like flashed up. You've got some leather stripes on there. And I think just the little bits of grey help the shoe as well. I think it would have just been too washed out if it was all this cream and kind of tan colourway. And these are, they, they are genuinely, genuinely beautiful. Um, I've had lots of people, again, all the City Series boys have gone for the Warsaw. All the runners and ZX boys, unsurprisingly, have gone for these. The colours on the 602, they were quite bright, so Gary's just switched up the colours. And I think it will match in. Now, I've got, I'm have got. i gonna drop it in now. I do not have the clothing this time around. Was not possible to get the clothing. Um, like I'm rushing just to get all these done. So to try and get the clothing in would have just been impossible. So I'm really, really sorry about that. But we have a life and I do this for fun. It is what it is. Just to show they've got, I really like actually the tongue label. Like just the address tongue label, it's just the little details. But just to show once again, the heel tabs, they have the uh, opposite heel tabs on there. Now sizing on these, again, I don't know if my feet are getting bigger or fatter, but these are on the snug side as well. So, I'd still probably stay with my size, but going half up, if you like a little bit more room, I know that sounds obvious, if you like a bit more room, get a bigger size, but you could probably go half up in them. Whereas when we did like the LG 2 Speciales, I wouldn't have gone half up in them, I think they were quite roomy. Yeah, great shoe. I'm gonna get onto what I like the most, I'm gonna drop it in later on, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, just, uh, just a beautiful shoe. So for those that you're into the runners, Definitely get your uh, get your names into these raffles. Next up, we have got the Yabisa SPZL. Um, obviously based on the Abifa, as if we didn't know this. Now, I'm not going to lie, I didn't know too much about the Abifa, so I'm not going to sit here and confess to be some sort of like vintage Adidas know-it-all because I'm not. I like trainers. You know, and I like the stuff I've grown up with, and this, these sorts of things sometimes weren't what I grew up with, and that's just is what it is. Let me break these out. Here we go. Check these bad boys out. I 
Now, not too much to say if I'm being brutally honest. It's a one-to-one -one replica, isn't it, of, of the original Abifa. Obviously, slight changes. So it's pure white leather and the leather, if I can show you, if it, the camera picks it up, the leather is really, really soft on the sides. But if you can see ever so subtly, the foxing around the bottom is just an ever so slight off-white. And also you can see probably even more so the uh, inside. Again, it's just got that off-white feel to it. And I think it just changed it from being a boring white train. I know it's just subtle things, I know, I know. But for me, if you can execute a white trainer well, there's nothing better, because it goes with everything. You know, you can wear them with shorts, denim, you know, cargoes, whatever you want, you can wear this shoe with it. Again, comes with two different heel tabs, which is nice. And also, you get a spare pair of laces in these, which you do in the ZX's actually, I forgot to show you those, but you get, this is like an off-white, which you can almost see. And you get a pure white pair as well to go in. I'll be sticking with the off-white because I think it just brings it a little bit like the LGs. The off-white laces, even though it's got a little bit of white on it, I just think it works better. On the bottom, you can almost see where it's the difference where the white kind of circle is to like the off-white actual sole type thing. Sizing on these, now I think these fit a little bit snug and almost too snug for my liking. I'm a size 8 as I always say. These are size 8 and I think, I mean, not necessarily the length, but I just think the width on these and it's maybe that just that bit of leather over the toe and I love the detailing. So I love how the, the piece on the toe runs up into the lacing system as well. It's just it's such a cool look, a little bit different. Some people have said like bowling shoes, which is kind of funny. I think these might be a little bit snug. Um, I'll be brutally honest, I've actually gone in for a pair of eight and a half for myself to try and see if an eight and a half would fit a little bit better. Um, so let's see if we get those. There we go, the, uh, the Yabisa, Ibiza. Again, it, it will be issue with the name that they couldn't use Ibiza. But. It kind of is what it is. And then last, but by no means least, we have got the Special Adilette. You cannot go wrong with an Adilette, can you? I mean, everyone wears sliders, do you know? In fact, hang on a second, we need, I think it deserves it. Check these bad boys out. I'm almost laughing. But what you'll see is it's ever so slightly off-white as well. It's not like a pure white. Um, if I can give an example, I'll grab the laces from the Yabisa. So you can see the difference in shade. It's ever so slightly an off-white. What's to say about a slider? I don't know. We all love Special, right? Let's be honest. That's probably why most of you tune into the videos, because you love Special. I know for a fact it's why most of the people are into the Instagram and stuff like that. So why not have a pair of special sliders? And I think I prefer these ones to the blue ones from whenever they were a few years ago, I can't quite remember. I really like this colourway. Sizing, I've told so many people already because we're running late, a little bit late with the videos. These are, these are small. So this is a size eight, I'm a size eight. And I'll slide my foot in it. And you can see like my heel is hanging off. You can't quite see it there from the tag. But the, my heel is hanging off. So you need to be going half up if they do half sizes, I don't actually know that, or a full size in the Adilette. So if you're going to go for the sliders, that's what you need to do. So just overall thoughts, I guess. I've seen a few people having it saying, oh, don't like this draw, blah, blah, blah. And do you know what? I actually, that's okay. We don't have to all like the same shoes. We can like some and not the others. We don't have to buy them all. Or some people are just saying, I'm going to buy one this time or whatever. Do you know, that's all fine. Like the current financial climate and things like that. Not everybody has as much money because bills are going up on everything. Petrol, fuel, you know, food and everything. So I completely get if people are just missing stuff and because they've got other priorities in life. 
here's what it is. I've seen so many people just saying, I really like, and then every shoe after it. Do you know, people have gone mad over the Statfen, over the, uh, the, the Tramp reissue, and I've seen one of my friends has gone absolutely mad over the obesity he's been waiting for an Ambifa to come. And then, like I said before, the casual boys, or typical casual boys, have been going mad for the Warsaws. And then the runner boys have been going mad. There's, there's something in this, in this drop for everybody. If you were going to hold a gun to my head and say, what would you get? I would be really struggling. I, I love a white special show, I'm not even going to lie. These Yabisas are really, really good. I, I do like them. I get they might not be for everyone because I understand like the, the, the bit on the front, completely understand it. But I just love a well executed white shoe. And this, I love my Burndons, I wear them all the time. This is a bit more of a sleek kind of classic, cl more classier white shoe if I can say it like that. But also, I do love the ZX's as well. They, they, they're, they're really, really comfortable and they, look, they just look so good on. So there you go. There's the rundown of the, the Special. Size wise, they're all a little bit snug, um, like I've said. So you could go half up on them all, really. I would personally stay true to size on the Warsaw, on the ZX. But like I said, I've actually gone in for half a size up on this, so I can compare them. The slider definitely go up. 100%. Right, I have rabbited on because I've had to cram them all into one video. Once again, I am really, I love doing the one drop a day when Gary does his. It's actually what we always set out to do. And, and like I've said, this is, I do this for fun. Do you know, I do it for the love. I love trainers. Do you know, I love Special. And it's just one of those things. Technology was not on my side this time round. Neither was school holidays or work or things like that, the other things that are in your life. So there we go. That's it for today. I will do an Instagram live at some point in the week, maybe Wednesday or something like that, so you can ask me questions. But thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, blah, blah. See you next time in the annex. Bye.